Hi everyone, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com coming at you with that second half of that uh, that Topps Museum Collection baseball case that we popped open not too long ago. This is six box, pick your team at number 14. A lot of great stuff here in Museum Collection. We saw Jason in the last video mark this five. That was, I think that was the dice roll, but this is for uh, pick your team 14. Very big thanks to everybody here, to the handful of you who got their team straight up. And pick your team 14, I appreciate it. Tim, you got last spot mojo before we pulled the remaining teams out for those two random number block randomizers, which we all did in separate videos. But here are the results of the New York Yankees, Rays, blah, 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 number block. And at the end of the video, we'll randomize everybody's names to see who gets the uh, non-numbered cards for those teams. Mostly base, some uh, non-numbered inserts. And then there was another one with a different set of teams. This was the Pirates one, Pittsburgh one, featuring all those teams. Those are the numbers right here. Where am I going to put all of this here? Here? Kind of do it that way. All right. Six boxes. Here we go. Good luck. The big baseball news that broke last night, Carlos Correa signing with the Giants. They had they had Aaron Judge money laying around. Did not land Aaron Judge, but then they landed uh, they landed a Carlos Correa what on a how many how many years? Plus 10 plus years. Thirteen-year, three hundred and fifty million dollar deal, according to according to sources. This is according to ESPN. That's a lot. Thirteen and three fifty. I mean, I'm sure. I guess the DH helps. DH being the NL certainly helps. Um, and I, I guess if the Giants win a World Series in the uh, you know, in the better parts of that deal, I suppose it's. I suppose it'll be worth it. You know. Yeah, that was a little, that was a little bit of news there for the Dodgers. They are they picked up. Uh, they're signing Noah Syndergaard to a one year deal. Classic Dodgers move. They've got a good coaching staff. Got a good pitching coach in Mark Pryor. And that's just and actually Syndergaard actually had a decent stretch with the with the Phillies. All right, there's Mike Piazza. Uh, ninety two out of ninety nine. So I'm sure the Dodgers can get a little more out of him as well, especially with with the way they've been able to work with guys like Tyler Anderson last year, Andrew Heaney last year. And kind of puts a little, uh, puts a solid pitcher into that into that rotation. I guess he liked Southern the Southern California area. Where is he from, Oliver? Do you have any idea? Yeah, he's only thirty. There's Cody Bellinger. He's with the Cubs now, so the uniform change won't look too different. Still be in a blue palette there. Cubs are a number block team, part of that Pittsburgh group. So that's 83 out of 99. So if you're not familiar with it, we go by that digit right there. Not that one, that one. 83 out of 99. Or Dodgers three, sorry. Oh, Dodgers are not a number block team. That's for Ed, sorry. Still Dodgers edition here. Ed P with the Dodgers. Sometimes we can we can see the actual sketch card itself, not, the, not just the reproduction. There's Ken Griffey Jr. Nice two-color patch, 33 out of 35. Daniel Delo with the M's. Justin, what's going on? How are you? 
Behind Blake Snell is Byron Buxton, 45 out of 50. He's going 75s, or he's a little bit thicker. Yeah, these are 100s. Twins, that's for Oliver. Mark, what's going on? How are you? Good evening. All right, behind Xander Bogarts is Josh Donaldson. That's a nice looking patch. Eight out of 15. Yankees are a number block group, part of the Yankees. Rays, Royals, etc., etc., a number block group. So like I was saying before, we go by that digit right there. So that's eight out of 15 Yankees. Eight will be for Ed P. And that's our first box. Next box. I was looking at Syndergaard, Ted. Apparently, it's one year, $13 million with uh, $1.5 million in incentives. Yeah, he was healthy enough to make 24 starts. I'll take that. Looked a little bit better in the... Uh, in a Phillies uniform. His fastball's down for him, but still still mid-90s. The ERA, not, not so good. But I think he went deep enough into games to still get still get decisions. It's kinda all it's kinda all you really need from a guy you, you want in your mid to back end of the rotation. It's just uh, have him just gobble up some innings, maybe get some Ws. Again, very similar to the Tyler Anderson, Andrew Heaney kind of deals. And, uh, and both of them went on to get paid. I think Carlos Rodon's still looking for a uh, for like a six seven year deal. I think. I mean, someone's going to give it to him, right? Anthony Rizzo, 47 out of 150. He's back with the Yankees. A Razor, uh, I guess Dodgers acquiring a JP Fairesian. Fairesian? You're going to get a minor league pitcher back after you. It'll just be. Yeah, I think he's still controllable through arbitration. Going to put him on the IL. That's sort of a longer play. And he's not going to pitch much this season, but it should be a bit of a reclamation project there. All right, Shane Boz reveals an Ian Happ dual relic and autograph. Two sixty-seven out of three ninety-nine. So Cubs seven. Part of the Pittsburgh group. Cubs seven is Barry Roberts. Last spot mojo. Quad relic. Alex Gordon. Thirty-two out of ninety-nine. Uh, Royals two. It's part of the Yankees group. On the other side over here, Brian Crouch. It's Jacob deGrom and a Buster Posey rally, two out of 50. That's for the Giants. That's part of the uh, Pittsburgh number block group. So Giants two, 
Chris Parent with the relic. Behind George Kirby is Paul O'Neill. 112 out of 125. Archival autographs. So Yankees 2. Brian. Brian Crouch with that one. All right. Next box. TV here. ESPN. Knicks at Bulls. Knicks are up 21-13. Five minutes left in the first quarter. Jays ended up with Kevin Crimear, huh? So now, Dansby Swanson remains the last shortstop on the market. I mean, if all if these other shortstops are getting this kind of money, what's what's he gonna get? Cardinals are one of the many teams to be connected to lefty Carlos Radon, but reports that it's unlikely the Cardinals are going to shell out the money in the years. The last report on his asking price, apparently, he's looking for over $200 million guaranteed on a deal of seven years or longer. Spencer Torkelson, 98 out of 99. It'll be for the Tigers, part of the uh, number block group, Yankees number block group, Detroit 8. It's going to be for Ed P. All right, behind the babe is Griffin Jacks, 16 out of 25. Nice three-color patch, some meaningful material for uh, Oliver and the Twins. Jack Flaherty, 45 out of 125, archival autograph. Newsflash, my yeah, Dansby Swanson signing with the Dodgers, or with the Jaspies, the Jaspies, for $5 million in break credit? That's a nice and excellent deal. That's an excellent deal. Cardinals, part of the Yankees number block group, so they'll go to St. Louis 5. That'll be for John, John H. Behind Chris Bryant is another Cardinal. Triple relic and autograph. That's pretty cool. Piece of his lumber right there as well. Got the Cardinals cream color and the Cardinals powder blue. Nolan Arenado's autograph, nice looking one. 20 out of 199, so that goes to St. Louis at zero. And that will be for, that'll be for Mark, Mark L. Behind Nolan is JT Real Muto, three out of 99. Quad relic for Ed P and the Phillies. Ed got the Phillies straight up in this one. Like I, I don't know how, how I'd spend $5 million in break credit. 
Let me just buy like anything anything NT related. And then uh, cases of cases of uh, Bowman and Bowman draft. And then just sit on those uh, those draft picks for years. Yeah, splash some eminence in there too, especially like eminence hoops. Some of those RPAs out of eminence hoops. That's pretty nice. Bobby Wood Jr. in there, numbered. There's a Willie Mays numbered card, 67 out of 150. That'll go to Pittsburgh, seven. It's gonna to go to Barry. And the Bobby Wood Jr. is gonna to go to Kansas City, three. It's on the other side. It's Jason K. nice. And a base Torkelson. Behind Juan Soto is Garrett Anderson. 138 out of 299. Mark S. with the Angels. And we got Keston Hira. 2 out of 50. Milwaukee, part of the Pittsburgh group. That'll be for Chris Parent. With Milwaukee too, a piece of Keston Harris jersey. A stack of non numbered out of the way. All right, behind Piazza is a Hunter Dozier. Piece of his lumber, piece of his jersey, and his auto for the Royals, Kansas City, a number block team. So that goes to Kansas City 4. Bobby with the number four. Last spot mojo in that number block. All right, and the last one here is a quartet of brewers. Christian Yelich, Josh Hader, Corbin Burns, and Keston Hira. 46 out of 75. Milwaukee six is for Joe. Joe Simone with Milwaukee six. I think Milwaukee came out and said they're not moving. Might be just GM games and shit, but they said they're not moving Corbin Burns or Willie Dennis, as had been rumored. Uh, I guess Giants signing Ross Tripling. Did I did, did I mention Matt Boyd Tigers? Much minor moves here, but Royal signing Ryan Yarbrough. Guardians signed Mike Zunino. Pirates signed Vince Velasquez. So it looks like, aside from Rodon and Dansby, like who are the two bigger free agent names that are left, I still could get what, 150, 200, 150 million plus type contracts. I think everyone else, now all the other sort of uh, fringe free agents being snapped up on those short, inexpensive deals.
And then I, I would think that the... Ooh, and there's the frame. Nice. And I think the, the trade market might heat up a little bit. I would think that my Dodgers will be involved a little bit more in the trade market. That say a Suzuki, 61 out of 150. Cubs one is for is for Joe. And there's a Wander Franco rookie card here as well for the Rays. We'll be part of that non-numbered randomizer. All right, behind Joe Ryan is Brandon Lowe, Brandon Lau. Nate Lowe, Brandon Lau, Derek Lowe. Dual relic and autograph for the Rays. Rays are part of the New York Yankees number block group, so that go to temp, and that'll go to Tampa Bay Zero. And that is on that side, that'll be for Mark, Mark L. Then a Jose Altuve, 79 out of 99, quad relic for the Astros. Ed P picked up the Astros straight up. And the big hurt is Blake Snell, five out of 10. Three color patch, meaningful material. Padres, picked up straight up by Andrew. And the frame behind Johnny Bench is, woo, gold ink autograph, three out of 10. Future Dodger, Shohei Otani. Wow. And then Mark S. That's for Mark S. Picked up the Angels straight up. Looking for stuff like this. Nice low number. Gold ink autograph. Nice gold frame. Real sharp. Very nice. All right, final box. That's the case hit too. One usually one gold, gold frame auto per case on average. What a beaut, right? Looking real good. Looking real nice. We got the TV, TV out there with the with the stream on our uh, one of our TVs and. People are like, ooh, show it. Hear the whispers out there. All right, final box. Hey, if you're liking this museum collection, guess what? We just loaded up another Half case break. Pick your team from a fresh case. So go to jazbeescasebreaks.com right now and pick your teams. No fillers yet. Miggy, Miguel Cabrera, 98 out of 99. Tigers, 8. Ed P. And final set of hits. Got a Griffin Jacks, 32 out of 35 for Oliver. And the Twins, some nice color in there. Pops. I haven't seen a, one of these, an, like an actual sketch card in, in a while. I'd like to see another one of those. There's Austin Barnes, archival autographs, 88 out of 299. Ed and the Dodgers. 
And we got another Hunter Dozier, Lumber and Jersey. Forty-four out of fifty. That's going to go to Royals four, and that's for Bobby. <laughs> the the other Hunter Dozier was also for number four. So Bobby is getting his uh, Hunter Dozier PC going, whether he intended to or not. And the last one, Miguel Cabrera, 19 out of 75. I think he's hanging it up after the 2023 season. But definitely first ballot career. Tigers 9, part of the Yankees group. Detroit 9 for Alex. There you go, Alex. And there you go, everybody. Really nice break. Now, let's see who's going to get those non-numbered cards. So let's flip back to random.org. This is for the uh, for that Yankees group. That's with Bobby with Last Spot Mojo. And then the other one is the Pittsburgh group with Barry with Last Spot Mojo. So you can tell the difference. One dice roll for both lists. Name on top gets those non-numbered cards for their respective teams. Snake Eyes, easy, two times. One and two. There you go, Bobby. Last spot mojo, strikes again, got some hits. Um, and you're gonna get those that stack of non-numbered cards for those teams. Snake Eyes, two times for the other list. One and two. Joe. Up there, Joe Simone, you'll get those non-numbered base cards for your team group right there. There you go, gang. I'm Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com. Thanks for watching. Thanks for breaking with us. And I'll see you next time for the next baseball break. Bye-bye.